before I came in the EDF project, I was basically in custody in Wandsworth. Um, obviously, because I've done some criminal activities, which obviously led me to do what I had to do. Um, before that, um, I was out of work literally for like a year and a year and a bit when I was in Wandsworth prison. They told me about the piano project, which obviously um, which led me to where I am right now. Through going through that, um, I've, I've been doing um, painting decorating work which obviously they pay for my funding and for my PPE, my, my protective, um, protective equipment, which obviously my hat, my boots, my travel expenses, which obviously I couldn't do because I'd just come out of prison. And um, they also help me with the training courses, which I'm, I'm into doing right now, which is the forklift truck training. I've been finding it very, very good because obviously it's makes me bounce back. It's helped me back into my feet. It's helped me stop doing the stupidness that I was doing in the streets. Um, and it's hopefully my life is getting better and better every day. Um, without the ESF project, I'll be in prison basically, probably, um, probably still be in the streets, do what I've got to do to feed my kids. Um, not somewhere that I don't want to be, basically. And obviously with them, as they help me to progress and I've changed my, I've changed my life around now and trying to get the better of it, and that's it.